Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 19 skill squad builder on my channel. So in today's video guys, I'm going to be showing you this really cool 1 million coin skill squad builder. Now as you can see, looking at it on paper, it looks like a rainbow skill squad. You know, we've got the Halloween card of Pepe. We've got that silver centre back there who actually has 91 pace. I'm pretty sure he is the fastest centre back on the whole of FIFA 19, if I'm not mistaken. Then we've got the inform cards. We've got the icon card of JJ Kotcher, who is hands down my favourite player I've used so far on FIFA 19. And then we've got the SBC Piatti card, the UEFA Champions League Martins card, and then we've got a few informs across the team. So overall, this team was probably my favourite team I've used in any FIFA. Um, it's even better than my FIFA 15 squad. It was just so fun to use. You know, we've got Charisma, we've got, you know, Piatti, um, Akotcha, and also Martins and Nani. It's just so many five-star skillers. And then I'm hoping that Ibra does eventually get, like, a special card, and they'll just make this team even better. But anyway, guys, this is the team. Now let's get into the highlights. So starting off the highlights for this 1 million coin skill squad, now the first thing I'm going to be doing is just talking about um, what was good about the team and what was bad. Now the first thing I loved about this team was the amount of 5 star skillers and it actually contains 7 5 star skillers. Um, what is just absolutely insane and it's probably the most 5 star skillers you can fit into a team um, and get 100 chemistry at the same time because sadly there isn't any 5 star skiller centre backs. Um, because if they were, they would be in this team as well. Um, so yeah, it's just a really good team, just because the amount of 5-star skillers. Um, a lot of the times when I'm playing with a team with not, like, probably I'd say under 5, 5-star five skillers, I sort of just, you know, try and look for the 5-star skillers and play the ball to them as much as possible. Um, but with this team, I just don't need to look for the players, because, you know, every play in an attacking position, um, like 9 out of 10 times, will have the 5-star skill move. So straight away, I can just go on a skill run, uh, what means there is a higher chance of, you know, scoring skill goals. And then the next thing I liked about this team was the defence. Now you're probably thinking three at the back, skill squad, foot champions, not really going to go too well. Um, but this weekend I've actually been playing with this squad in foot champs and I managed to finish gold three um, with six matches remaining. So I could have potentially got gold two with this squad. And I would say that I'm probably an average FIFA player um, at defending and, you know, when attacking. Um, with skill moves, I'd say I'm, like, slightly better, obviously. But, um, like, I'm probably say I'm an average FIFA player. Um, even though I do play this game quite a lot, I'm not really very good at, like, competitive FIFA. But I managed to get 14 wins in foot champs with this team. So it shows that it is good competitivenessly. And um, also the defence is very good. Um, I think it's got a really nice balance. You know, you've got Pepe, who isn't the fastest, but has really nice physical stats and a really nice defender. In. Then you've got um, the silver centre back who has like a really weird and long name, um, but he has 91 pace, so he's absolutely rapid and he's really good at, you know, just sweeping up um, those through balls from the opponents. And then the final centre back in this team, Apara, is both fast and has decent defending stats. I think it's around 70 something physical and I think it's like 77 defending if I remember correctly. So, you know, I've got one absolutely rapid centre back, one really fast centre back with decent defending and a decent physical. And then you've just got one, you know, pure centre back, you know, not the fastest, but insane defending and insane physical. And surprisingly, it actually worked very well. You know, I came up against some really hard teams, um, you know, like some icon teams, some like really sweaty um, teams with the, you know, the red monthly cards or the weekly cards as they're now known as. Um, so yeah, this team can definitely compete in foot champs and it did score some really nice skill goals. So overall, this team is just a 10 out of 10. I haven't played with a better squad since my FIFA 15 squad. Um, and in that squad, I had like second in form Shikawi, um, a team of the season Depay, and then the footy is Kresma card. And I've actually managed to fit Kresma into this team, um, but he's in form card this year, who is probably my second favourite five star skill, I'd say, um, after JJ Okocha. And then also Nani, as you can see on this skill run there, does a nice ball roll to a ball roll hocus pocus, to the fake drag back, to a ball roll step over, to the um, forward like fake pass thing. Um, I do a nice waka waka, do an off ball dribbling, to waka waka, go for the finesse shot. And then just goes marginally wide of the post. If you're looking for like a really cheap alternative to Neymar, I think Inform Nani is a great player. Um, you know, he doesn't really have the finishing stats, but apart from that, he is very, very good. Um, for the final chance here, as you can see, we get the ball with Akuna. He was decent. You know, I don't really have too many clips with him, but he did a decent job. And of course, he has the five star skill moves. Um, Jalson Martins there doing some brilliant nice skill moves. Plays the ball off to Ibrahimovic, does the Blanco help, flicks it over his head, flicks over the defender's head again, and then smashes it in off the post. So guys, this has been the highlights, now let's get into the end screen. So guys, this is now the end of the video. 
Um, the team overall, as I've said, was absolutely insane and just so, so good to skill with and also surprisingly very good in foot champs. So if you did enjoy this FIFA 19 skill squad builder and would like to see more videos like this on my channel, I'd really appreciate it if you left a like just to let me know you do like these videos. Um, also, tell me in the comment section below what was your favourite skill goal and then just leave a timestamp with it because um, yeah, I'm actually going to be working on a new FIFA 19 compilation probably within the next month. Um, and as you know, you know, I didn't have Wi-Fi for a month and a half, so um, I would have had a comp out by now if it wasn't for that. But anyway, I am going to start working on a comp now, um, trying to score some really nice skill goals for that, and then try and get a nice edit on it as well. So guys, this has been the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and see you tomorrow.